Welcome to the CTTP training videos. RDOC Method 347 Determining Moisture Content by the Speedy Moisture Tester. In this video, the test for moisture content of a soil using a 20 gram Speedy Moisture Tester is demonstrated. Clean the meter before each use by brushing the chamber to remove any residual materials. Place two steel balls into the chamber by tilting the chamber on its side and rolling the balls into the chamber. This will prevent damage to the pressure port. Stand the meter upright and add three scoops of calcium carbide reagent to the chamber. Place a small container on the scale platform. Zero the scale and place the standard sample size, which in this case is 20 grams of soil, into the container. Weigh the soil to the exact mass specified by the manufacturer. Place the soil in the speedy moisture tester cap, taking care not to lose any soil. Tilt the meter on its side to prevent mixing of soil and reagent until the cap is secure. Tighten the cap to provide an airtight seal. Raise the meter to a vertical position to mix the soil and reagent. Tap the cap with your fingers to help move the soil from the lid into the chamber area. Turn the meter on its side, horizontal, and shake the meter with a rotational movement for at least 60 seconds. Read the dial to the nearest 0.1%. If the dial reading is decreasing, this indicates a leak in the seal of the cap. Discard the test and start over with a new sample. Repeat the shaking process for about 15 to 20 seconds and read the dial again. Continue shaking and reading the dial until three identical consecutive readings are obtained. Record the final reading. The dial reading represents the percent moisture based on the wet mass of soil placed into the meter. However, reported moisture content is based on the dry mass of soil, so we must use the conversion chart to convert the dial reading. In this chart, whole number values are listed in the left column and tenth percent values are shown across the top row. Find the value where the whole number and tenth percent values intersect. For this test, 12 is highlighted on the left and 0.4 is highlighted at the top. The intersecting value, 14.1%, is the reported moisture content. Loosen the cap and allow the pressure to escape. There is typically a mark on the cap showing where this will occur first. Remove the cap and dump the contents into a container. Clean the meter with a brush. Verify that the soil sample has been completely pulverized. If not, the results should be discarded. Report the moisture content to the nearest 0.1%. Please visit our website at cttp.org for other training videos and modules.